from 2015 will shape tech in 2016. Um, take for instance the Volkswagen scandal, uh, which will have far-reaching implications beyond the auto industry. Um, this scandal has highlighted the fact that today the DMCA prevents you um, from inspecting and fixing software on any device that you buy, even if this software might be endangering your health and safety. Um, from an enterprise perspective, what this means is that software that runs your production line um, could lead to you violating EPA, FDA or, or GMP norms, but you still don't have the right to inspect and fix that software. Um, the DMCA will definitely look into this next year and I believe that the changes made to the DMCA will have far-reaching consequences uh, about um, how software is uh, written and delivered to different devices. Um, I, I, I predict major reorganizations uh, in the IT departments of uh, traditional, of non-IT traditional companies. Um, and the reason I say this is because, you know, let's take an example, let's, let's look at the auto industry. You know, innovation, business, uh, paradigm shifting innovation in the auto industry is, um, is not coming from the General Motors or the Chryslers or the Toyotas. It's in fact coming from Google, which is a tech company, Uber, which is a tech company, or Tesla, which is a tech company. So I believe that um, next year there will be more pressure on the IT departments in uh, traditional non-IT companies to deliver uh, business innovation as a part of the core strategy of the companies. And I'm not sure whether IT departments are prepared for this. So this will be interesting. Let's see how this pans out next year. I feel, or at least I hope, that 2016 is finally the year where tablets replace laptops as the bread and butter tool of choice for cubicle workers. Um, Apple released the iPad Pro, which is uh, intended for use in the enterprise. Uh, Microsoft released the Surface Pro, and HP has also come out with a tablet. Uh, with prices falling, I hope that we will all be using tablets in our cubicles next year instead of laptops. <laughs>